So we are going to try this one more time. One more time. Hubson is ready to go. And it goes back up in the air in one, two, three. Yes, take off. The home point oh, has been updated. Please be mindful of the new return to so, home point. I mean, it's understandable that the tracking was lost, but okay, that's not what we want. Let's put it against the yellow background real quick. See if that helps at all. No, you do, it's tracking the wrong thing. You, okay. Now it's tracking the drone. Let's go up with the drone. Come on. Please track it. It's not tracking the drone. Why not? Go up. I just don't know why. Is not tracking the drone at all. Is it too far away from the drone? So the drone is doing a great job, but the tracking of the drone is terrible, really. If I go right, will it track it? Oh, it's lost already. If I go forward, will it track it? So much for it tracking. Okay, it's doing a terrible job. So we're gonna stop that. And instead, we're gonna just go for a little flight. Because we can do that. So um, how do I feel about the update? The drone update, I gotta tell you, is nothing cool. It just really is not cool. The update that we got did not do anything special. Um, it is flying, sure. We'll try to do what we did yesterday with the um, with the DJI. So we'll come down a little bit more <laughs> and um, just go up a little bit more. See what happens in that, and we'll do some circling around the object. And we'll see how well it tracks this sculpture here. So we'll try that again like we did yesterday. What we'll do... We'll be very mindful of stuff because I'm not crashing this drone today. I refuse. And it does a good job. But to be honest with you, I don't see any changes compared to how it was doing before. So has this new software update that wasted 10 minutes of my life made any significant difference? I don't think so. So So there we go. So what we'll do is, and we'll double check that there's absolutely nobody around, uh, is we'll go check out those beautiful butterflies. We'll show, go check out those butterflies over here. It's a beautiful spot. 
And very gently, we're gonna try to circle around here. It's beautiful, it's really beautiful this area. But anyway, there's a lot of uh, pop-ups right here. I'm not sure why it's talking about GPS interference or something like that. Let's um, gimbal it up a little bit. Go take a look at that uh, Deloitte area since we're in a nice spot here. We'll go nice and high up and turn. Again, one of the issues here that we're going to face is same as last time is that on this bird we do not have that cool ability to raise the camera so yeah it is what it is guys there are a bunch of cute birds circling the drone right now. They're very tiny. So we're going to come right down again. Hey, how's it going? It's a beautiful day. So you guys have now seen what you can see from the camera. And we're going to head back down. Gently and surely because I'm literally right below the drone right now. We still have about 65% battery, so we will be able to get some other flights in today with this drone. I'm not sure what's going on, but whatever it is, it's painful to watch. It's painful to watch, guys. I'm going to bring the drone back to its original spot and uh, do a nice landing. Hopefully a nice landing. I don't know what's going on. Is it the remote that's having issues with the battery? Is it... I don't know. I just feel that every time they update something on these drones, it just gets noisier and more annoying to deal with. So. Landing. Do a nice landing and perfectly where I wanted it to land. There we go. It's talking about maybe possibly needing a compass calibration and a bunch of stuff. Well done, Hubson. You've really ticked me off today. Well done. There we go. It's what to expect, right? What to expect. Um, not a whole lot. Not a whole lot of difference in the way that it flew. It flew just as well as it did before. Did we see a 50% increase in beauty? No, not in my opinion, but anyway. They wasted 10 minutes of my life that I'll never get back. <sighs> Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you all in the next one.